What's happening guys, Celtic CC here. So this is part two of the rolling video. I'm going to be doing the treasure mining and I spent quite a lot of gems so it's a lot of tries for treasure mining. Um, so I should be getting all three of the chests hopefully. Um, I managed to do it with about 64 tries on my main account getting all, the, all three of the chests and it also gives out an event card as well. And this chance to get some floating all powder on the account as well, which isn't such a bad thing. It's a shame it's only like times one and stuff. So we got castle chest four, six, three, and a couple of magic powders. You know, I mean, um, you got to give credit to IGG for stepping up the events. Do you know what I mean? I mean, it's this is really good, like, you know, for free to play accounts. It kind of changes the, um, the complexion of the game. You know, it's made the game a lot more free to play friendly. Uh, so now it's definitely worth saving up your your gems and rolling on the weekend when this treasure mining event is on. No doubt about it. Okay, so castle chest five, castle chest six, castle chest five, a four, and a three. Uh, the one thing about this, and uh, you've got to be careful of, is going out and checking your mailbox because um, I did it on my main account before, and. Uh, so we got castle chest two, a three, a five, and a four, and we got the bronze chest key. I did it before, and it kind of deleted everything. And um, so that first lot got four castle chest fours, three castle chest sixes, five castle chest threes, three castle chest fives, and one castle chest two. So happy days. You know, I mean, it's like. Um, <coughs> You know, I mean, most of my account, only my main account is the one I spend any money on nowadays, and I don't even spend a lot of money on it anyway. And, uh, you know, the rest of my accounts are, are you know, are, are now completely free to play pretty much. Do you know what I mean? I just don't spend money on them. So an event like this, which gives a chance to get more igniting stones and uh, event hero cards on the account, on a free to play account, is awesome. There's no doubt about that. Okay, let's see if we can reload. Yeah, apologies for this. My uh, emulator runs a bit funny sometimes, you know what I mean? Uh, okay. Right. <laughs> it's going a bit batty. Okay. All right, let's, let's get going again. Hopefully I can get all three chests. Um, I don't know where this is set. I mean, you've got to do to get the chests. So we've got a castle chest three, four, four, two, and silver chest key. So we got the silver chest key. Four, five, three, two, and a three. I mean, the castle chests are excellent. I've always liked the castle chests. It's one of the things I, I used to go for a lot in the bazaars. Do you know what I mean? Um, the castle chest packs, just because you get a lot of good stuff on there. A lot of variety of items. So an event that gives, you know, hands these out is, is fantastic for free to play, no doubt about it. Um, you know, it's a little bit of a shame with the magic pay. It's the only kind of, you know, kick in the teeth about this event that it only gives like one magic pay. But if you do the event a lot, those magic pay will eventually add up. But you do want to be seeing the castle chest, really. Uh, castle chest five, six, four, and a three. Yeah, I think what I might just start doing is um, just saving up the magic powder on all my accounts because I kind of, you know, if you guys give me some free magic powder on my free-to-play accounts, I tend to use it up quite quickly. What I think I might just start doing is saving it all up. So we've got the gold chest key, which is nice. I'll do one more and then go into the mailbox. So castle chest two, a six, a four, a six, or oh, two sixes, awesome. Okay. So it was five magic powder, eight castle chest threes, seven castle chest fours, uh, five castle chest twos, four castle chest fives, and six castle chest sixes, which is awesome. Hmm. Sorry, sorry if this is getting boring. If you were, if you're getting bored of watching me um, collect all the items, it's probably a good idea just to skip to the end of the video, and um, 
to see everything I got then because I'll, I'll just open up all the castle chests at the end, like you know. Okay, castle chest five, castle chest four, a two, three, uh, two twos, and a six. Yeah, I think you know because this event's new and I've only done it the second time I've done it. I think I'm pro what I'll probably end up doing is um, kind of making doing a normal rolling video and then showing all the you know do I do a plan for prizes basically just kind of skip all this and show you what I got at the end kind of thing you know so we got a three a two a six and two magic paders a four a six two sixes another four and a castle chest two okay so I left a bit early on that time Oops. All right. I have to keep track of that. So I got two castle chest fives. Um, the fives and the sixes are the best ones to get for, for uh, breakthrough crystals. Uh, four castle chest fours, four castle chest twos, um, six castle chests, uh, three castle chest sixes, and four castle chest threes, and some more magic payder. Um, I'm not really keeping track of the magic payder too much. It'll just add up, you know, if I keep just doing this event and saving up the free payder, you know, I might actually manage to get. One of the newer event heroes, of, you know, later on in the future. At the moment, Alpha Max, like you know, the um, top tier one to get, so he's the most difficult. I assume it's like, was it Valiant Saint Death or something? For the tier two, I'm not sure. So Magic Pay the Castle Chest three, Castle Chest two, a Castle Chest three, and a Castle Chest five. Not the best that one. Only just got the one Castle Chest five. A four. Two fours, a magic powder, a two, and a five. Yeah, if castle chest fives and sixes are the ones I want to be seeing, do you know what I mean? It's, I mean, the castle chest fours are not bad as well, but, um, you know, I mean, it's igniting stones and breakthrough crystals, you know, that, that kind of thing, and books are the best things to be getting on this account. Um, so, a, a castle chest two, a five, a two, a three, uh, two threes. Uh, a four, a six, a five, magic powder, and a castle chest two. Still only 20 in the mailbox, is it? Okay. Right, so we got four castle chest threes, five castle chest twos, four castle chest fives, three castle chest fours, and one castle chest six, and a bit of magic powder. Yeah, I do need to start putting some more work into my backup accounts, because what I've been doing is um, I've been a bit, like, you know, busy recently with work and other things as well. So I haven't been putting max effort into my other accounts. I've just kind of been maintaining them. I'll make sure I do like Guild Wars and stuff like that, you know. Um, obviously, it helps having quite a few accounts for Fortress Food because the other day I was like, no one turned up for Fortress Food and I was on my own and still managed to get a win taking on a guild, which was fun. Uh, Magic Pay the one, a castle, one Castle Chest 6, a Castle Chest 3, a 2 and a 3. Uh, a 4, a 5, two fives, a 5 and a 1. Yeah, it would be nice to see most castle chest sixes because they're the ones that give the most igniting stones, so they tend to. And um, they also give the, um, what are they call the zenith stones as well. So a four, a two, a three, and a five. Yeah, it definitely seems to be like, you know, the sixes are the rarest with this event, which is expected. They're, they're the best for igniting stones, no doubt about it. Three, a six, magic powder, a four, or two sixes that time also. That's good. I like the artwork as well with all with the Ice Lady and the little cavern and everything. It's pretty cool. It's nice this event's not running too badly either. So, you know, some of the events just go crazy on my emulator. So a three, a one, a two. That's just two. I at least got a castle chest six at a time. Two, a four, a six, and a five. Okay, happy days. Can't quite see what's in the mailbox. That's the only problem. I'll do one more and then go and uh, claim everything. Well, I'll do. I'll open everything up at the end as well. So, cast just five, a six, a five, and a two. Just to show you, you know, in case you're not sure, of, like, the kind of prizes that you get from, like, all the castle chests, you know, I'll open up at the, them at the end so you can see the kind of stuff you get from it. So, um, nice to get six castle chest sixes our time. That's good. Right. So, if I take it down to about, um, so there's like 25 left, I'll split it into, into, into twos then. So we've got a five, a three, a six, a four, and a three. 
Yeah, it's the only thing I I um I don't think I can keep track of how much magic pay do I got in total because I'm I'm not sure how much I had on the account. I might have already had some. Um Castle Chest five, a six, a three, and a two. But you can see, I mean the magic pay there itself, you know, it's it's not you're not gonna get a lot from doing this and you don't really wanna be getting a lot. You can, you wanna see the castle chest um over the magic pay there. So it's cast two castle chest twos, a five and a three. Two, two sets of twos, a five, a three, and a magic paid of one. Cast just three, a four, a three, a four, uh, another couple of fours. Okay, so I'll go and collect everything. So we've got four castle chest fives, which is nice. Two castle chest sixes. Okay. So this will be the last lot for uh, doing the mining, and then what I'll do, I'll, I'll, I'll go back to the mailbox, um, collect everything, and then um, I'll open the chests up, then come back into the event, and you know, open up the castle chests in my warehouse, and I'll come back into the event, and I will open up the, the gold, the silver, and the chest, uh, yeah, the gold, the silver, and the bronze chests on the treasure mining, and uh, see what I'll get from the event legend card, so I, I think it gives out an event anyway. Uh, two, twos, uh, that won't be good, there's a lot of twos there. A, two, a load of twos, at least got a six. Castle chest three. Uh, a three, a two, a four, and a couple of magic pay there. Six, a four, a three, and a two, and another magic pay there. A four, a two, a couple of twos, and a couple more magic pay there. Seen a few too many magic pay there there now. So three more to open up. Hopefully it will be all castle chests. I don't want to see any magic powders. <laughs> yep, castle chest four. That's fine. Nice when we get a five or a six at the end here, but chances are slim. Oh, there's a castle chest five. And last but not least. Another castle chest five. At least got a couple of castle chest fives to finish, which is nice. So collect everything. And I think I'll have enough room to open everything. So it doesn't give any castle chest ones, um, which for this account is probably not a bad thing. But some people might not like that because the the ones do give out like the stone skin stone skin uh, sets. Like so, so castle chest twos. Let's open these up. See there, you get some uh, prime mirror card threes, lots of blue crystals. Um, it gives out Empire Crest, which is really good on this account. These slimes are always good. These are good. I mean, it's, this is awesome for for a free to play account. You know what I mean? It's like you know, I never thought I'd see the day where I'd be getting this many castle chests on on the on the account, like, which is really nice. These give out you know talent cards, primeval card threes, um, talents. And these crystals are always good as well. Nice to have uh, regenerate and stuff like that to choose from. Castle chest fours. Um, I mean the slimes in the books and actually the warden stones are all of it's good. It's fine. Whatever we get. <coughs> yeah, books. That's nice. I mean these red crystals are good as well. So we got slimes, which is nice. So the castle chest fives give a books and igniting stones and zenith crystals and these are actually these are quite valuable on here as well. Do you know what I mean? So um. Yeah, it's all good stuff, apart from the, the level 5 talent chests, I guess. The only thing I don't really want to be seeing. Um, that's a bit disappointing, actually, not to get any um, igniting stones on the first one. So 200 igniting stones and 600 bucks, which is nice. Um, and 3 of the level 9 talent runes. And the 6s give out uh, these skins, which I do actually need. Hopefully, it's at least give me some igniting stones, you know what I mean? But, you know, get some in it. Okay, 600 to start, that's nice. Didn't get any on the next one. Right, so a thousand ignited stones, which is really nice. Uh, the Zenith stones are, are good as well. Um, five of these. So, do you know what I mean? They're really good uh, castle chests on the on free to play game, no doubt about it. Um, nothing I need out here. Backups are fine for all of them. I don't think there's. Um, I think I've got every hero that's in the in here. Yeah, happy days. Uh, I didn't give out any doves, though, which kind of sucks. Right, so we'll go and open the, um, what's it called, the uh, 
the treasure mining chest. And uh, hopefully that event legend card was um, a set prize in the gold one. I think it was the gold one I opened up. So I mean, so I mean, if you're spending like you know, um, probably try and spend over thirty thousand gems, you should be getting all the chests. Then do you know what I mean? I mean, I managed to get it with about I think it was eighteen thousand gems spent on my main account, but I may have got a bit lucky there, so I can't say for definite. Right, so we've got a prime hero card for three of the Valentine's box, two thousand nine stones, which is nice. So the same prizes as um on the. Uh, and I did it on my main account. So I got the official event, 10 coins, which is amazing. Because, um, you know, getting event coins is really difficult, free to play. The title talent badges are good. Super pet snacks, nice. And last but not least. So we got the Prime Hero Card 5, 40 Battle Monkeys, uh, 2 Camera Rock 6s. 15 camera up fives and the 200 magic payder. So you get extra magic payder onto the account. So, um, you know, this event's awesome for free to play. It just completely changes the whole complexion of the game. Do you know what I mean? It's 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 allowing uh, the free to play players to start competing um, a bit better. So, I mean, you see that all the all the good prizes you get from it. 200 magic payder, which is really nice. Um, so I'm going to save up the magic payder. And so how much magic paid have I got? Let's have a look. I won't bother doing plan for prizes because this video is going to, you know, be going on long enough. Um, so I've got 232 paid on the account now. So if I just keep saving that up, I might be able to, you know, shoot for another event hero one day. So primary card fours. Um, oh, actually, there's some heroes here which I don't have. Let's see. I, I'm rooting for Ripper then. All the rest will be backups. Ripper would be nice. Plant Warrior. Yeah. Yeah, I need to start putting a bit more work into this account. I've kind of just sort of like been focusing on my main heroes and pushing their breakthrough levels up. So the event card, anything but Rambad, is going to be something new. Um, a Valiant Saint Death would be really nice, but I'm assuming she's the rarest. And a Hot Shot. So a Hot Shot's pretty much a standard, but it's still nice to get one. And Prime Hero Card 5 gives a Phobos, which is a new hero. Awesome. So, um, yeah, this, you know, this treasure mining event is awesome for free to play, guys. Uh, it completely changes it. Um, you definitely want to be trying to, you know, use free to play gems on this event. And, uh, you know, Tree of Choice is good as well. Gives you a um, chance at event legend card. Um, you know, there is a chance though if you get like two or three event legend cards, you end up with like you know two hot shots. So, so that's the only thing with it. But um, you know, I hear hot shot is usually the one that gets given out a lot. Do you know what I mean? So I might got lucky getting ran bad. Um, you know, I got hot shot on my main account as well. So you know, so happy days. Yeah, really good event. That um, what I think I'll do in the future is just kind of show what what I got at the end rather than going through the whole thing but you, you get the idea with it now it's really good for free to play and it's worth giving it a go alright and cheers guys